This video describes the new interactive workplane modification Nomen, now available in Esprit. The new workplane Nomen lets you quickly translate, rotate, and align workplanes with interactive controls within the graphic view, giving you a new, streamlined workflow for creating and editing workplanes. To get started, select the Modify Workplane command from the Home tab or use the button on the Heads Up View toolbar. The Workplane Modification Nomen offers five modes of control Vector Alignment, 2D Translation, 3D Translation, Plane Alignment, and Rotation. To align the Nomen to a vector, select the arrowhead for the vector that you want to align, and then click the edge to align it to. To translate along a vector, click on the arrow body of the desired vector. To define the translation distance, you can move the mouse to the desired position, type in the distance to translate, or align to a snap point. The snap point does not need to lie along the translation vector. For full 3D translation, click on the Nomen's center ball. Move the Nomen to the desired location. If you select a snap point, the Nomen moves in all three vectors as necessary to reach the point. For plane alignment, select the desired plane region on the Nomen, and then select the plane to align to. The Nomen moves to align with the plane, with the origin at the point you clicked. To rotate the Nomen, select the desired arc to rotate along. Then, click a vector to rotate, or enter the rotation value in degrees. A compass appears to show the current position as you move the mouse to rotate the Nomen. Keep the mouse cursor inside the compass area to constrain adjustments to 5 degree increments. Move the mouse outside the compass for finer control. Note that you can also still enter a numerical value here. When the Nomen is in the desired final position, you can either press escape or save the position as a work plane to exit work plane modification. The function has full undo support as well. Undoing a move also exits work plane modification if active. The modifying work plane stays in position and you can save it as a new work plane until you move it again or activate a different work plane. The work plane modification nomen is a useful tool to define work planes for tool axis orientation and it can also help you quickly orient a part file for machining in Esprit. First, we will align the XY plane with the top face. Activate the work plane nomen and then select the XY plane portion. Click on the face to align. Note that the work plane modification nomen remains active so that we can quickly make the next transformation, which is to align the X vector. Click on the red arrowhead, then select the edge to align. Finally, we will center the work plane on this hole. Click the center ball and then mouse over the snap point at the center of the hole. Now that the work plane nomen is aligned the way that we want it, press escape to exit transformation mode. You can also save this position as a work plane to exit. Select the part and use the Align Plane Transformation type in the Move dialog with the XYZ plane as the destination plane. Click OK. The part is now aligned with the global XYZ origin at the specified location. Thank you for watching this Esprit product feature video. For more information about this and other new features in Esprit, refer to the Release Bulletin and Product Help.